What it is now and what it started, it's kind of two different things. Initially, when we built the store, it was going to be a yogurt shop. So my wall is built out for yogurt machines. And then like a month before we opened the store, we changed our mind and completely scrapped the whole idea. As we started doing the funnel cakes, because, you know, everybody loves funnel cakes, people started asking for ice cream. They started, you know, wanting to try this or wanting to try that. And once I started deep frying things in the funnel cake batter, I realized I could deep fry everything in it. Put a nice little funnel cake coating on there. So now it's the deep fried cheesecake, the deep fried Oreos, the deep fried banana split. As a kid, people go to the fair. You know, and a funnel cake is like, you're going to the fair, you're getting a funnel cake. Uh, a lot of people haven't had them since the fair, or now they know they don't have to wait to the, uh, to the fair gets here to get it. So people just really love it, man. I think they just uh, related to having a good time as a, as a kid or whatever, going to the fair, and now they can come here without waiting in line. You know, everybody now is on the move. So we added some games, and once we did that, now nobody wants to leave. People are coming for three, four, five hours. They're playing games. You really can't do that anywhere. You know, there's no place that you can sit down with the family and put the phones down for a little while and interact and play the old board games. The biggest thing is I wanted them to be in a better mood. You know, with the music and the atmosphere and the vibe, I really wanted people to walk away with a smile on their face. After five years, Eric and I um, have really had a blast here at Funky Suites. We've enjoyed the area, and we definitely want to thank all of our customers that we've had. Um, but we're going to take a year off and go on vacation, go see some family and friends. We didn't want to close the store down because it was such a part of a, the community that we didn't want to take that away from everybody. Mm -hmm. So we wanted to keep on, so we sold the store to a wonderful new couple, Rami and Sam, who are going to keep up all the same traditions of the stuff that we have going on. Hi everybody, so this is Ram and Sam, my wife Sam. The, we are the new owners for the Funky Sweets and we are happy to be part of Funky Sweets. Here I'm gonna bring our mini donuts back. Please visit us in Funky Sweets, we're gonna make you happy. Yeah, baby, that looks good. <laughs> Funky Sweets is in St. Petersburg off of 4th Street North. You can find out more about them on our website at fox13news.com. Sometimes, so Bonnie, you just want some fair food and you don't yeah. want to go to the fair. Right, this makes it easy and gotta, delicious. Yeah. Yeah. That looked like breakfast. Ooh. All right.